Hey guys, this is Edwin, excited to be joining you guys and going through how to create a five minute rough mix. This is great when you get a new session, when you get a, a session to, to let's say uh, to mix or some, some or a session that somebody else has been working on, you're going to get your hands on them. This is a great, great approach and it's my favorite part it's 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 super fun because you really don't have to think about any 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 uh, particular thing it's just let's start mixing so here we go um, this is our session here as you can see all the modules all the faders are down only the subs are up and the reason I do it is because I already set up my template I just want to start mixing I just want to start listening to how uh, everything sounds so here we go let's play this let's see what do we have here okay we have yeah. Awesome. Let's see what we got here. All right. So we bring this up. Okay, we have acoustic guitar. We have some uh, a wind blower here. Okay, perfect. And guys, this is as simple as just bringing the faders up. You, the reason you want to do this, the reason is why it's so important, is because you don't want to start opening plugins right away. You want to see what you know, what you your, what's the game plan here? You know. All right. Okay. Let's see. So we got bass. Bass might be low. And I'm gonna stay steer away uh, from the vocals just because I hear it's 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 a ballad. Let me see. I, I see that there's a lot of instruments here. So let let's focus on those for right now. Some sort of some acoustic piano. This is awesome. And what's going through my head, guys, is really just bringing faders up and seeing, okay, what what's gonna come up? What what are the different textures? Think about that. Think about your frequency spectrum as well. You know, because um, it's gonna affect in the in, you know throughout your your mix. This is a mix that you're gonna be going through. You know, for the next five six hours. You know. Sound like uh, strings. Looks like we got some strings going here. Beautiful. This is gonna be fun, guys. Very. It's it, it's in the mids. I, I hear. So I'm thinking the grand piano and the strings. We're gonna have to somehow figure out a way. Um, how are we gonna? How do we gotta let those two get along? I see here drums. Awesome, I hear acoustic, I mean electric, I'm sorry guys, electric uh, guitars, the store, uh, story guitars. Th those, that's more like a icing in the cake, really I'm not thinking about that, I'm thinking about, you know, starting from the bass up, just like a house, you know, we want the bass to be gr the best, you know, you, the basis of everything, the foundation. It's a whole band, guys. This is this is this. These are the f my favorite records to mix um, because there's energy to them. There's a heartbeat. Um, there's there you know is musicians playing. Not that there's anything wrong with it, you know just you know music made in computers, but you know you you want to you want to hear that you want to feel the music. So a lot of it tends to be quantized, which kind of killed it here so awesome so after I hear the first pass I want to hear the 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 loudest parts of the song um, and that's where I want to focus on that's why I want to start building keep building my mix uh, within these five minutes so for this song is the bridge so let's listen to that perfect
and make sure guys make sure that when you guys going through these rough mixes um, you don't miss any any modules any faders uh, because like for example this this low part where the acoustic piano had two separate tracks of just one line um, it's easy to miss that so let's not you know make sure you have everything down these are cute this, these electric guitars keep up And also what I hear guys for the strings, um, they're out of tune and that happens. So it's like, okay, if I don't have the time to tune them, uh, be, be it through a third party program, um, then what do I do? How do I kind of make them fit, you know? And as you, know, as you see, there's no reverb. I'm not adding any reverb, anything like that uh, because I just want to get the feel of the song. It's really not a rocket science here. not bring in perfect awesome and let's write this write the song out Perfect. I don't see that I miss anything um, outside the vocals. All good. Perfect. Now, guys, as you can see there, that was a five-minute uh, rough mix. And the number one key, I'm not sure if you guys noticed, but I never soloed anything. Um, that's something that I do. I never solo when I start mixing. I never put on solo kind of just bring the faders up, you know, sometimes uh, You know, sometimes I actually make it a rule to never solo anything and just kind of feel everything out, you know um, But yeah, hopefully hopefully you guys uh, like this and get, let's get let's get this going